Good morning and welcome to Eagle's Nest Live for your AHS Morning News. Hello, I'm Sophia. And I'm Lexi and we are here to provide you with the news for today, Monday, December 4th, Christmas Shirt Day. Congratulations to Garrett Morgan for making KMEA All-Star Jazz Band on the baritone sax. Way to go, Garrett. Apollo family, there are several tags on the Giving Tree located in the guidance office. Please stop by for a tag. The Thespiana Society has rescheduled Cabaret Night for this Wednesday at 6 p.m. This means that there are now three fabulous shows for you to enjoy this week. On Tuesday, the Eagle Family prayer Players will present pri Pirate Christmas on Wednesday. Cabaret Night will be at 6 p.m. and on Thursday night at 6, the intro to Theater Night of One Acts will perform. Hope to see you all there. Attention all students in the Little Mermaid Junior, please check your email for an important message from Ms. Berry. Hello fellow people of the world, it's already December, and guess what? It's super lit. Hashtag popcorn tins. It's December, Parker. I know, look at my shoes. <gasps> what I like about December is Christmas music. No dasher and dancer and comet and cupid. Hashtag December 20th. We like fuzzy socks. <laughs> I'm excited for snow. Let it snow, let it snow, let it snow. Hashtag spending too much money. My favorite part of December is being able to wear sweaters all the time. I like getting all the presents. Hashtag jolly. That Lindsey Wilson and Campbellsville trip is Friday. It's a great chance to see two small colleges in one day. We're going to have no cost of the trip. Please have these in by Wednesday. We extend the deadline. And now for Miss Dame for acceptances to college. Hey, good morning. We want to celebrate some seniors who have been accepted. We have Kaylee Case who's been accepted to U Pike. Hayden Pulliam has been accepted to Brescia University, Carly Burden, USI, Paige Ferguson, Butler University, Michaela Tapp, Murray State, Molly Trunnell, Belmont College, and Georgetown College, Alyssa Purcell, University of Louisville, Courtney Miller, WKU and U of L, Aaliyah Peevler, WKU and Murray, Jalen Taylor, Western, Bellarmine, USI, Malia Yamada, Western and U of L. Sophia Eldridge, UofL, Juan Tomas, MSU, Murray State, Brooklyn Patterson, UofL, Elliot Campbell, Campbellsville University, Hattie Martin, UK, University of Cincinnati, Eastern and Transy, and Miss Sadie Harvey, American Dramatic Academy of the Arts. Congrats. Keep going, seniors. Have a good day. The Key Club has set up an angel tree again this year. If you would be interested in selecting an angel this Christmas, please stop by room 212 to pick one out. All gifts must be turned in no later than December 13th. The Student Council's annual 12 Days Until Christmas Break Spirit Days has begun. Today is Christmas Shirt Day and Tuesday is Candy Cane Day. Check the weekly memo and posting throughout the building for the entire list. Due to the unexpected water main break, Reindeer Day will be Monday, December 18th. We hope to see everyone participating in these Christmas Spirit Days. Hey, Christmas. 
Congratulations to both the Apollo girls and boys bowling teams who placed third out of 16 teams in each division at the 7th Annual Manual Crimson Baker Classic in Louisville on Saturday. The Lady Eagles averaged 187 in their 20 Baker games, while the Apollo boys averaged 210 in their 20 games. Best of luck to both teams as they take on Greenwood tonight at 515 at Diamond Lane South. The Apollo GSA Christmas Party will take place tomorrow, Tuesday, December 5th, from 3.30 until 4.30 in room 321. Please bring a small, inexpensive gift wrapped if you would like to participate in the gift exchange and your favorite Christmas treat if possible. There will be an ugly Christmas sweater contest and games with Miss Jackie and homemade treats courtesy of Kevin and Stephen Brown. All are welcome to attend. Monday, December 4th through Friday, December 8th, Apollo will be having our annual Nickel War. The money will be collected in your first period class all throughout the week. Each circle will have a winning first period who will receive a prize and then the class who raises the most money will be the overall winner. To get in the spirit of giving, all donations will be going to the Youth Service Center for being able to purchase gifts for family need this Christmas. My first period class is winning Nickel Wars. My first period will win the Nickel Wars. The homecoming dance will be held this Friday night from 9 until midnight in the Little Gym. Tickets will be sold during all lunch shifts on Thursday and Friday. The cost of each ticket is $5 and no tickets will be sold at the door. Please remember the following. You will be turned away if you are not dressed appropriately. This is a semi-formal dance. Entrance to the dance will be through the set of doors closest to the band room. You will not be able to enter through the gym lobby. And lastly, the Spanish National Honor Society will be sponsoring a coat and bag check. The cost will be $1 per person. Please see Mr. Poff if you have any questions. For today's lunch, you have the choice of chicken chow mein or pizza in the global fair line, chicken and stuffing in the mama's kitchen line, chef salad or sub in the sub sad salad line, several sandwich choices in the sandwich line, and pudding is the dessert of the day. Lo man. We would like to wish the following co-curricular activities good luck as they participate in events this evening. The academic team as they host Penny Ryle meet number four at five in the Commons area, the boys and girls bowling teams as they host Greenwood at five at Diamond Lane South, and the boys basketball team as they host Webster County with the JV playing at six and the varsity at 730. And don't forget, that was part of the 12 days of Christmas until Christmas break tomorrow is Candy Stripe Day. So wear stripes. Thank you. Have a great day. Good morning, Eagles, and welcome back. I have a few announcements uh, this morning, and I need to catch up on some birthdays that we missed out on this past Friday. Several people have already asked if we are going to be making up this day uh, before Christmas break. Not exactly sure about that, but we will f hopefully find out today, and we will communicate that. Uh, I'm not sure if finals will be affected or not. Secondly, regardless if we make this day up or not, we only have two weeks here remaining in this semester. It's very important that students work hard and try to make those grades up that are deficient. Um, and hopefully everybody gets those much needed credits at the end of this semester, uh, and, and especially in second and third period classes. As far as uh, birthdays go from this past Friday, um, Tan A celebrated a birthday, and Brandon Durbin, Caitlin Long, Ashley Snow, all this past Friday, along with Miss Mackenzie Murphy. On Saturday, Trevor Edge, Jacob Nefrady, Krishna, excuse me, Krishna Patel, Alexis Williams, all celebrated a birthday. Yesterday, Andrew Aubin, Hunter Brand, Haley English, Nolan Whitaker. Also, Mr. Jeremy Cameron uh, celebrated a birthday yesterday. And then today, Hallie Mullen, Lucas Piercy, Madison Poe, Louis Zimothy, and Jonathan Tidd, all celebrating birthdays today. Let's make it a great day in Eagle Nation. 
pledge. Attention, salute, pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all.